All right, you guys, so starting off with Hair by Beauty Lumina. It is a 360 lace frontal wig and 22 inches in the style Water Wave. And so now I'm just showing you how many sections I'm using for each side of the wig for my highlight. So I'm using two sections in the front. Also, I'm using two sections in the middle. And then lastly, I'm using two sections in the back. Hey, pass that dutch, double dutch, right? So this is what I basically did. So I used different developers just to get some dimension in the wig. So the two sections in the front, I'm using 20 volume developer. Then the two sections in the middle, I'm using 30 volume developer. And then the last two sections in the back, I'm using 40 volume developer. And I'm doing this on both sides. And then I allow the bleach to sit on the hair for about 30 minutes. Um, now, after I did this and after I washed out the bleach, I realized that um, it really did not make a difference with me using different levels of developer, but you know, of course, trial and error, this is just how I learn. But I think next time, of course, I just wanna get a better quality of hair just to see if this actually works on different quality of hair. And then next time I'll probably also use um, some Wella toner, but you know, at the end of the day, we all learn, y'all. We all learn, but you guys, just let me know what you guys think about this process. Um, if you have done this before, definitely go ahead and let me know. And as you can see, um, you see now, you see the bleach looks like the, the dimensions is basically the same. So I basically wasted my time in the beginning of this video, but I'm showing you now how I part my wig for my half up, half down, and I'm just putting the front into two sections. And then I also put the back into two sections and I'm just hot combing my hair where the part is just so, um, everything is nice and flat and seamless. All right, and again, like I said before, so I'm just hot combing the front as well. That way the hair in the front is nice and flat. And then I'm also going to put the front section in the ponytail. That way when I actually put the wig on, it's easy for me, you know, to style the wig as I desire. Here comes the fun part. So I'm using the Eben Wonder Lace glue, the travel size glue. And then I'm also using the Eben Tint Lace in light warm brown. And you guys, this lace spray is the bomb. Look at my nails, y'all. Bomb.com, shout out to Lizzie Nails. But um, as you can see right now, I am just determining um, where I'm gonna cut the lace and I'm cutting my lace into sections. That way it's easy for me to apply the wig with the lace glue. All right, you guys, so now I'm just putting on the lace glue on each section where I cut the lace. That way I can just take my time in each part that I'm doing. And as you can see, I'm spreading the glue back. That way the glue is spread evenly. And then after I dry the glue, then I'm going to lay my lace down um, on the dry glue. And so I'm also gonna do this um, to each section that I have cut. 
and um, I'm also doing extra glue on my sideburns because for some reason every time I apply wigs onto my head the sideburns always tend to come up I don't know what it is I feel like everybody has this issue and that's why most of the time I just stick to closure wigs but you know with me using the even wonder lace and also the free spray it actually held up pretty well and so after this after I applied the lace on this side I'm going to do the other side I did have to fix my baby hairs off camera but you'll um, see the finished results in a few All right, and just finishing up with styling my hair, I did use the Cream of Nature mousse on my hair. The mousse smells so, so good. And I think the curl pattern is really pretty on this wig, but the only thing about this hair is it gets frizzy really, really quick. So just keep that in mind if you do decide to purchase this wig, I will be putting the links in the description box below. But you guys, I love how it turned out. Now, like I said before, I'm used to just doing my own baby hairs, but I think the outcome of this wig turned out really well. Of course, I just need to work on everything else. But let me know what you guys think about this wig and definitely do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will definitely see you guys in the next video. Peace out, girl stay out, bye.